How's it going, everybody? Jezza here, and today we are back with episode four, four, four of Shout Out Saturdays. And I am super pumped because today we have more than five people. Um, I've been getting so many requests to be in this series and it makes me super excited because one, I get to keep going with this series and uh, never really done like a series extended beyond like two episodes. Um, and that's only because they happen to, I happen to play the game twice, <laughs> um, which is bad on my part. But, um, not only that, I'm also excited because I like to see interaction between, uh, my channel and you guys and among you guys and your channels. Uh, the point of this is obviously to give shoutouts to people. This isn't for me. This is for you. As many times as I said this, I need to keep saying it because, um, I know that sometimes people do shoutouts so that, like, uh, in the tags you can put like uh, grow your channel and get more subs and all that stuff but um, that's not the point of this the point of this is to recognize people that have some true talent on YouTube and um, should be recognized for it so without further ado let us get to the first shout out first one up we have um, Fadabulous Comedy. Now, I haven't actually done a, uh, someone not gaming, I don't think. Someone not gaming related. And he actually isn't. He's more of a vlogger, which I think is actually really cool. Sometimes I like to watch vlogs rather than gaming videos. Uh, and it's, it, he's really funny. I mean, it's in the title of his channel, Fadabulous Comedy. Um, like, for example, the other day he had a video about um, his crazy ex-girlfriend. And I personally really liked that one because, like, it kind of just randomly took a turn for the worse in that video. Um, you just have to watch the story. Um, he's a really good vlogger. He has a lot of cool topics to talk about that are really uh, pertinent. And I think it's really cool what he's trying to do. There's, uh, you know, there's not a lot of people that... Uh, can just sit in front of a camera and talk about something that's on their mind for a couple minutes and keep you entertained, but he definitely does do that. So, uh, check him out, Fadabulous Comedy. I'll leave his link in the description. Next up, we have Nate Toaster. Uh, one of the first people I actually met once I got onto YouTube. Um, he makes a whole bunch of different videos, and honestly, like, even if I don't know what the game is, or if I've never seen it or heard of it, or whatever the case may be, he always makes me laugh. Uh, for example, I have no idea, I've never heard of this game Cabela's Savage Lands, or, no, not Cabela's, it's not related to that, but Savage Lands, um, he played a playthrough of this game, um, and <laughs> he was trying to explain to me the game, and I'm kind of bad with games I'm always behind um but yeah he is uh really just good at commentary honestly like uh he makes you laugh he says things that are just like so out of the blue and it's just funny I don't know that's that's just me I really uh like his uh content I definitely think you should give him a look-see which I've never ever going to say again, even though I've said that like a billion times, so I probably will. <laughs> but, um, that's Nate Toaster. Definitely go check him out. I think his content is really great, and he's been promising that he's going to continue to put out content, and uh, I think he deserves the recognition. So next up, we have Epic Crazy Life. Now, I um, found this channel to be really interesting because it's actually like a whole family involved with this channel uh the the dad takes care of like all the social media and editing of the videos and by the way the editing is like really on point <laughs> i think it's it makes some of the videos like even funnier um but then on top of that the people in the video are actually the kids um and they're pretty young uh from what i can tell so it's, it's interesting to see that, because most of the time on YouTube, 
people are like in their 18, like late teens to early 20s, and uh, these are kids, like definitely earlier than 18 years old, and I think that's really cool that they're getting into it so early on, and uh, making great content at that, and I always appreciate the fact that they're like one of the first people to always comment on my videos, and I always appreciate the feedback, so definitely go check them out, and uh, they'll be really supportive in return, so that's awesome. Next up, we have Roshank Redemption. Uh, Roshank, I uh, don't really know, I can't remember how long ago I met him, but he's a really cool guy. He does shoutouts as well on his channel, which is uh, a good reason to go check him out, because I'm sure he'd be willing to do the same for you. Um, but he, I, I found his channel most interesting because uh, I had actually just pre-ordered Fallout 4, found his channel, and saw that he was playing Fallout 3, like, fully through. And I, uh, was, I got addicted to watching it, because honestly, Fallout 3 was, like, one of my favorite games I've ever played, and that's, like, not even an exaggeration. So, uh, he puts out videos, honestly, that people enjoy watching, like, he gets tons of views on it, and I think that's well-deserved. Uh, so, and he plays a whole line of different games that I'm sure somebody will, you know, find one of them at least interesting. Uh, so, Roshank Redemption, go check him out, uh, and if you enjoy Fallout, the Fallout series, essentially, definitely go check him out. He uh, does an awesome playthrough and always keeps it entertaining. Next up, we have uh, Player Character Theater. Um, they, I met them pretty early on as well in my YouTube career, um, and I met them early on in theirs as well. Uh, they're still pretty early on, uh, but they've put out like loads of videos, and I think that's awesome that you that they're starting out like putting out as many videos as they can to kind of show their community that they care about what they're doing. So, uh, they play a variety of games, and they mostly play horror games, which I think, you know, personally, said this a million times, but, uh, watching that as someone who plays horror is always fun. They've, uh, played Five Nights at Freddy's, they've played, uh, with the Oculus Rift, which is always fun to watch because that just makes things ten times scarier. Uh, they played The Witcher, and uh, they've also been really supportive of uh, the video that I put out at 1500 subs. Um, my, like, five tips on how to make your YouTube channel better and how to grow. Uh, they they made a response to that, and apparently they've been doing really well with the tips that I've given them, so I really appreciate that they're using what I've told them and uh, are growing as a result. So definitely go check them out. Uh, they're kind of a new startup channel, so I think that uh, they're doing really well for just starting up, and, uh, and I wish them luck in the future. I wish everyone luck in the future. <laughs> Um, so normally, this is where I'd end the, uh, shoutouts, but five is not enough. I'm deciding that, you know, everyone deserves to get a shoutout, and I, I always feel bad when I can't say, like, oh, you can be in it next week. Like, I, I feel bad, uh, telling people that they'll have to wait. Like, I know that <laughs> I can't just do a hundred shoutouts in one video, but... Um, I'm gonna try and include everyone as much as I can, so, uh, on to number six. Um, number six is Big and Prime, also a new YouTuber. Um, he's been, on uh, been putting out, uh, videos for, like, three, four weeks now, almost a month, I guess. Um, been playing a lot of Mortal Kombat and Bloodborne, which, personally, I enjoy. Um, but on top of that, I actually, uh, have played with him on PlayStation 4, and I just know him as a person. And I think he's a really cool person, like, really down-to-earth, really funny, uh, entertaining to talk to, and just, like, a cool guy all around. And I think that matters most, even more than the content you, that you put out, is the type of person that you are. Um, and he's definitely just, like 
a good guy, uh, tries to make the best content that he can, and he definitely, definitely does care about his YouTube channel and wants to see it grow. And I also want to see it grow, so uh, when I see someone that's just starting on YouTube, I try and help them out in any way that I can. So, I hope this helps you out, buddy, and uh, and keep doing what you're doing. So go check him out, Big and Prime. Finally, um, I don't really think that this guy needs a shout-out, but I just, like, I need to, because um, I've been talking to this guy, he's just so cool. Um, and it's very different from the channels that I normally shout-out. His name is Dale Pendlebury. He, um, if you've seen any of my reaction videos, he actually made the videos that I've reacted to. For example, the, uh, um, Morning Makes You Jump, uh, Scary Girl in My House, like, though, and the First Person Horror, uh, he made those videos, which is, like, beyond me, honestly. Like, uh, he's such a good, uh, filmmaker, and I think that's so awesome that he's doing what he is doing. Um, he also is a musician, and, I mean, like, he, he's got, like, 37,000 subs, but honestly, uh, I just, I just think that he deserves you guys to just go check him out, because his films are just amazing. Uh, and he's just also a really cool guy to talk to. Like, I was just talking to him over Twitter, and, uh, He's so supportive of my channel, and I can't even thank him enough for that. So, uh, definitely go check him out. Um, check all of these guys out. Like, as I've said, uh, before in these videos, um, I'd just like to kind of end it with a message to the people that I shout out. And that is today that, uh, you guys are a really unique bunch. Like, it's not just gaming videos this time, it's, uh vlogs, it's, um, musicians, it's, like, uh, it's short films, it's gaming as well, it's, uh, everyone from young to old, it's just a whole variety of people, and that's the beauty of YouTube, is that anyone can do it, and whatever your talent is, you'll be recognized for it, and I think that's just so cool, like, it doesn't matter what you want to do, if you want to do it, like, that's why it's called YouTube, not, like, their tube or our tube. Well, I guess it could be. But, um, basically my point is, these guys are really unique, really cool people, like, in person, and, um, I definitely think they deserve the recognition. Um, I'll say this, uh, a million times, and I'll just keep saying it, like, these, uh, guys deserve a shout out. I'm, most of these, I mean, actually, all of these people never ask me for a shout out. Most of the people that I do shout outs for aren't asking for it. I'm just recognizing them as a YouTuber and saying, uh, you are worth it. <laughs> you deserve the subs, and I think that you should go check them out. So, without further ado, uh, I will end the shout outs here. <laughs> That's seven channels for you guys to check out today. I hope that you enjoyed. And again, if you would like a shout out, please leave it in the comments below or message me wherever. Um, I'm always willing to do it. Uh, and I, I do think that all of you deserve a shout out. I will get to you as soon as possible. I promise that I'm trying to um, I have a list compiled of, like, everyone that's asked me, and I'm, I'm doing my best, so, uh, bear with me, I will get to you, I promise, and go check out these channels, they're awesome people. So, that's all for today, guys. Oh, and by the way, I finally caught my breath from the last video, but, uh, si besides the point, <laughs> um, that's all for today, guys. I hope you enjoyed, and... I'll talk to you guys wherever. You know, I got social media links if you want to go check those out. <laughs> uh, follow me. Stalk me. Whatever you want to do. Don't stalk me. Uh, whatever you want to do. <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying. Anyways, love you guys, and thanks for tuning in, and I'll see you next week for another Shoutout Saturday. Jezza, out.